and vice versa? No, don't hold your breath. But it's important to note the tactic here. The left is committed to distorting history and destroying the past while demonizing anyone and everyone who stands up for American values and traditions. What started as the removal of historical monuments has now become a full-on assault on presidential legacies and the movements, namely the conservative movement, that was created. And by the way, if a conservative does manage to secure a post inside one of these old dinosaur bastions, he or she will be vilified, condemned without cause, and driven out. Because the fanatical left, well, it's no longer about winning in the arena of ideas for them. It's no longer a debate and may the best person win. No, 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 no. Instead, they just work to take players off the field with blindside hits. Hey, buddy. Look at this. America, this is democracy. If Democrats want to make a difference, I have a suggestion. Why not start engaging? America, <laughs> they violent, aren't they? Uh, look at David. Uh, don't he look better? Uh, he does this every year. Just before summer starts. Not since we've been over here. First time since we've been here. David, how long we been here? Three We're going to discuss it. Ain't that something? Three months. Uh, whatever, David. We, 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 you're clean now. You don't look. You look better. Uh, anyways. Oh, uh, these people are violent. I mean, God dang it. Uh, 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 dignity. Well, what is that? Uh, no, dignity health. It's where patience touched me. Audacity. And we can't forget Adventist Hospital. Incredible. Oh, my, my leg hurts. Let me sit here. Oh, <laughs> America. Medicare. Is the cop that's supposed to protect us from the for profit insurance like Medicare Advantage? Instead, we report the crime against humanity and they decide whether they're going to take it or not. Then they call the perpetrator. And then the perpetrators, like Anthem. I mean, there was uh, too many. Too much ignorance. Too much megalomanic ego. It's surprise. <laughs> uh, my glucose is getting much, much better, I'll show you, as is my blood pressure. But with that goes parts of my body that are in agony. Savas, United States Congress lacks clarity of understanding who their boss is. It's like that child. Y'all are impressed with her. It takes courage. It takes courage to call America garbage. It does. It takes car courage to get data off the internet and then spew it out and marinate it with lies. 93 trillion? Are you crazy? Well, you are. <laughs> I couldn't... Well, I really admire her. I mean, it takes courage. And she's bringing up... I go to hell. As you admire her, people are dying in the United States. And that's the poor, the homeless, 
the disabled, the senior. And don't forget the crazy, okay? We done. We got USA farmers giving us their leftovers that their pigs won't eat. Surprise. The Department of Justice has not called. It's been three weeks and one day. Incredible. And nobody cares. Really, you don't. Because if you did, we the poor, the old, the homeless, the disabled, the crazy, wouldn't be enduring your I care. I'm having chest pains. And that's because my blood pressure is finally normal. Ain't that something? And you want me to say Medicare, who we pay the bills for, Love America. It's your children. It's your mother, your cousin, your whatever that works in government. They have no integrity. They don't care. They're not suffering. They're getting their paycheck from us. I heard a commercial about this hard thing. <gasps> I wouldn't let them touch, oh, Garcia's heart. Oh, uh, no, health care is, it's most like the easy bake oven of Claus Barbie. More like a Hitler. And these people are Koreans. They are. And I think at 67, I should be allowed to say my experience with these pretty porcelain chucky dolls has been, whoo! And then the Hindu and the, oh my God. And of course, the Hispanic Latino. Oh, uh, like La Corina, y'all need to call this number. Okay, I can't see it. Look at the number. Okay? Y'all need to call La Corina of Dignity Services Management. That woman don't have enough work. I wonder how many disabled seniors she terrorized. I'm having chest pains. I need to check my blood pressure. And I need to rest. Oh, uh, no, but I needed to say this. Oh, we got media. <laughs> well, it, um, I, can't, I can't help but admire her. <laughs> it's shit like you entertainers, commentators, the media. I can't help it admire God dang it. She got someone looking on the internet, putting in all this garbage that happened in the past, putting it in with her garbage and making it her own. Uh it's like that Chuck, that homosexual. Mm. And the other, they're not deep patriots. They hate America. They're like the United States Congress. And you elected them. I'm having chest pains right now because you elected them. Or Medicare wouldn't be run like it's a little empire. And these Positions wouldn't be murdering us. 
No. Uh, nothing you change can change it. I don't care who you are. If you can't speak the truth, then baby, there's something wrong with your education. That that woman has courage. Oh my God. Next you'll be calling Michael Obama a lady. Maxine Waters. <laughs> a saint. <laughs> no baby. You're an Elijah Cummings. And I guarantee you civil rights whatever. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. is visiting you, baby. Why ain't you listening? You need to get off the uh of Farrakhan and Al Sharpton. And the list just goes on and on. Because, baby, we dying here. And that means black America, white America, green America, yellow America. We done. What y'all gonna do about it? Tell us your story. Hold your grandmother in your arms. And on the background, do a hologram. The hospital that murdered them. Whether it be Adventist Hospital in Bakersfield, California, or Dignity and Mercy in Walking, or it is Gray Harbor Community ER in uh, Aberdeen, or whether it be Providence in Olympia, or whether it be Providence on Gleason in Portland, Oregon. How you doing, baby? How y'all doing? Suffice. It's not going to change, baby. Your goddamn children are working in the government and have no qualms in hurting an old blind woman. You must be awfully proud. Awfully. It's like the Obamas being proud of their daughter. Ah! She can hoop, he can she? Anyway, no, baby. You're the sin. You're the crime. And, baby, you're going to do the time. They still haven't okayed it, and it's free. What does that say to you? And this is a population of over a million. It's spooky. I mean, it got that. It, it, it like you, you're walking a Kruger. And, and, and you just took an ambient. <gasps> wake me up. Oh, God dang it. Wake me up. Come on, Edgar Casey. Wake me up. No. Congress is killing us. They write the laws. You understand? They write the laws. Who survives? Baby, we all have old people living around us. We all see the homeless. Are you going to be like a Bakersfield prayer convention? Are you going to be like the fishermen? What do you mean you ain't got no Medicare? Let's work on this. You need to ask questions to these people. And then the people. Oh. Just remember 129. And it's 127. Just think. The poor. The homeless. Got to deal with this psychotic bullshit. <coughs> anyway. Let me upload this. I got a lot to do, but it's been over two years since my blood pressure been normal and my glucose been this good. No, it is the Korean. They want five piece of 
Chucky doll. I mean, they look birdy. Aren't they like bird porcelain dolls? It look like that Chucky doll, don't you think so? Mm-hmm. And it is the Hindu and see. And it be the Hispanic, the Latino, the Mexicano. It be darker who be playing these games. Anyway, uh, let me upload this. President Trump, baby, you hold on. Uh, we're going to take care of this Medicare bullshit. Too many people are dying, President Trump. You can cut EPA to where it becomes a myth. But you're not going to fuck with Social Security. And you sure ain't going to fuck with Medicare. And you're not cutting food stamps. Uh 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 uh. We're not cutting food stamps. What we're gonna do? Have the USA farmers give us food? Uh uh. You ain't touching them fucking food stamps. You need to come here and bite. You're gonna need some of this shit. <gasps> Go down to Catholic charity. <gasps> You'll become a Muslim. No, you will not cut food stamps. You understand? I'm pissed at them too. God, I can get a job, do something. But how can they get a job? They can't even get housing. And you going to cut their food stamps? Uh-uh. We're going to talk, Trump. i got to rest, baby. I'm up by midnight. Listen, Trump. That shit, uh-uh. We're going to veto it. You know who is we? We the poor. You ain't cutting food stamps. You understand? You understand? You good funding to Planned Parenthood. That's a KK outfit that's killing the children. You good funding. Hey, your insurance will be as ours. Who the fuck you think you are, Congress? You got better insurance? We can't send our children up there to be interns. Look at Mr. Clinton. Oh, uh, no. This is your fault. Your blame. And you not touching my gun. Well, I don't get food stamps. I'm an American born. Oh, uh, but no, you ain't cutting fucking food stamps. Uh-uh. And that wall, I don't know what's going on, but y'all better get that thing done. There's more shit coming along the road. Anyway, Americans, you see old people, ask them how you doing. And mean it. Anyway, let me upload this. Oh, God dang.